Man, Pete, if you're into grilling, you have some really fun, fun stuff to make, uh, make it even better. Well, we have stuff that if you're not a, a great griller, will make you a great griller without even trying. One of my, like, I gotta talk about this first. It's my favorite thing. I won't eat salmon anymore unless it's on a cedar plank. How's and that it, work? It's so easy. You just uh, soak it in a little water for like 20 minutes. You put your salmon on there. I'll uh, put, we have some salmon seasoning and I'll thin slice some lemons, put it on there and just cook it uh, on the barbecue for about 30 minutes at 350. It, it's on. Believable. That flavor from the wood gets it's, all it's in there. Unbe it's unbelievable. Ooh. And we have in all different woods, but cedar for uh, salmon is my favorite. You can also do vegetables and meats and other things. So Yum. Yeah. And you can use these planks, wash them up, use them over and over you again. You can use them again, sure. And love it. Just spectacular. I, I just love it. Speaking of that smoke flavor, um, talk about easy. This is some of the coolest stuff. They, they look like cans of tuna fish. It's not. <laughs> These are actually wood chips. Um, they've got pecan flavored. They're, you know, just a Here's couple of bucks. And cherry. And same type of thing. You just open these foil pouches and, you know, if you want to be smoking ribs, but you don't own a smoker, you know, you just perfect. Just, just throw them in the gas or, or wood. All you do is on this one, you just pop out the top and stick it in and, and it, it's amazing the smoke. Great flavor. Really I mean, neat. take ordinary barbecue chicken to a whole nother level. Look, let's talk about what's that. This is fun. This is, you've heard of uh, beer roasted chicken. Yes. Well, this one's ceramic. You can put it in the oven or on the grill and uh, you put your, your beer or wine or soda inside here and you put your chicken on top. We even have a larger one for turkeys and you cook it upright, and I don't know if you've done that, but it's amazing when you do that. It's juicy, the it's, skin gets it's, tender. It's unreal, yeah, just spectacular. It. Under eight bucks, you yeah. gotta love that. All sorts of great sauces and seasonings and rubs, and you really pride yourself on carrying some great locally made barbecue sauces. Uh, we love um, <laughs> this one here, Jimmy J's, that's that good stuff. That is spectacular, yep. really good. And this is fun uh, seasoning. And it, it sounds gross, roadkill uh, grill, but it's absolutely really amazing. good. Yeah, really yeah. good. Yeah, it's excellent. Let's this, talk about these plates. These are hard to find. This is a sizzler platter, and what it does is it keeps your steak hot. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times uh, we have people that search for these and can't find them. We usually have them stacked up uh, high because we sell so many of them. And we have them in large and small, and you can eat on there, and it also keeps your uh, steak hot. There's the double kebab skewers, which are nice. The, 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 you know, sometimes it's hard to grill with kebabs and everything falls off, rolls around. Right, with the double, they, you, you, you get it through uh, in two places. So as you turn the uh, kebab, it doesn't, you know, the food turns with it, which is nice. You can skewer it good. Look at this, uh, having a barbecue. What a fun, not only place to put your sauces, your ketchup, your mustard, but it's a great decoration for the sure. table. Another great item is this, this is a digital uh, fork, thermometer. So. I never cook chicken, right? I have three little kids and never want to give them salmonella, so I over, always overcook it to where it gets too dry. Too dry, yeah. exactly. So now with this, as you flip it, you stick it in there and it immediately tells you the internal, internal temperature and you know that it's not ready to take off, so you flip it and, um, and I, now my chicken is perfect. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. Speaking of chicken, I understand there's some great chicken out on the grill. Let's uh, head outside. Dave's going to show us this new grill that you guys are raving right. about. Well, you can see we carry all kinds of grills. This is a, uh, something we've just started doing. Uh, and we have all different uh, grills that do different things. Uh, steam, smoke, uh, roast, slow cook, we can do brisket. But uh, we're gonna uh, go outside really quick and show you uh, the Komodo Joe, which is one of my favorites. Hi Amy, this is our Komodo Joe. It's a new product we have here at Cook's Corner. It's a grill that can do everything. From slow cook, to grill at very high searing temperatures, to indirect cook. You can cook a pizza on here, bake a pizza, you can bake bread, and today, I'm cooking some chicken. Looks amazing, and I don't see charcoal here. No, the charcoal is actually natural wood charcoal, which is below that deflector plate. And with the deflector plate, it creates a convection oven. The heat cooks from the bottom, and it comes around on the top. This chicken's been on for about 50 minutes, and I never flipped it, and it's done. Sure looks good, yeah. yum. Yep, it's, when you cook this way, it stays very moist. Everything stays very moist. It's actually hard to screw up when you cook with this grill. We love it. Thanks, Dave. Looks great. I think I need to put one of those on my wish list. All right, let's go try some.